This time around, we get lost in the back of the bush. Right, we're in the back of the bush right now. I get told by a park ranger not to fly my drone. Just get told off by a park ranger not to fly the drone. And I get smashed by some waves. Got absolutely smashed by a wave. Going to Tamil Point Campground, uh, it's just below Aladala. Mm. Uh, three hours, three hours, three hours to get there. We're gonna go to fall. Yeah. Completely fall. Completely uh, fall. So now we're trying to find a one that's supposedly close by, but we're in like the the fire trails fire trail. Like we're in the back of the bush right now. Trying to find this clearing. Apparently it's just a clearing. It's on Wiki Camp, so I don't know. Good morning. <sighs> morning. We made it to a campsite. Yes, we did. It's a uh, bit of a mission. Can't you fly the drone in national parks? Can't fly it in built up areas, can't fly it in national parks. Where can I fly it? the drone? <laughs> it's like <laughs> some private property over yeah. a paddock. <laughs> we bought it so we can fly it. Yeah. Expensive know, piece of equipment. How hard do you get how hard is it to get permission on off national parks? If anyone knows, let us know. Yeah, let us know. What are we gonna do now? We're gonna go to the beach. I lost my thongs. We thought we might come down to the rocks to have a look. I'm pulling that. Just got absolutely smashed by a wave. <laughs> lost her thong. Dragged across like the barnacle ridden rocks. Yeah. So dumb though. It's like watch people on the internet do that shit. And... <laughs> oh, so we're gonna go back up to the campsite and patch him up. Stupid Matt. Matt being dumb 101. <laughs> Why do I do that? We might need to get a new um first aid kit after this. Just use everything in one go. Why is that? Put it all on. Why is that like that? We just had a rescue helicopter guy come and patch Matt up because I have no idea what I'm doing. Yeah. So what? thank you, 
Thank you. We didn't get his Thanks name. Helicopter man. Yeah, and then there was another guy who um, also offered us more bandages. So thank you to him as well. Yeah, lots of people. Yeah, it's out. good. What an idiot. <laughs> but we have both thongs. <laughs> yeah, I found. <laughs> it's gonna hope it stops bleeding. We're on the way to Milton to go to a medical center. Don't believe this cart's not stop bleeding. <laughs> We got stitches. We got two stitches. <laughs> Alright, too happy. <laughs> two stitches. Tetanus. Tetanus bandages. Oh, you'll be okay. <laughs> We're gonna go back to the campsite. I'm gonna see if that winery's open. Treat yourself time. I deserve it. <laughs> we have a visitor. No. Oh no. It's found the rubbish bag. Oh wait, there we go. Oh. Hey. <laughs> Did you hear? <laughs> <laughs> Rude quality that was. Yeah, go and eat some vegetation. <laughs> you don't, yeah, you don't want this human food. It's no. not good. Not good for us, no. not good for you. Yeah. <laughs> And this is the finished product. Yours looks a bit better than mine. <laughs> I presented mine a little bit better. And a glass of red. Woo! Well, this is a bit, but this is a glass of red. <laughs> Cheers, honey. <laughs> so, we're pretty much just at the point where we're just eating this flatbread with Persian <laughs> feta. It's delicious. I don't know if we mentioned before, I don't know if we took a video of it, but it's just flour and yogurt, natural yogurt, uh, mixed together. So it's really simple and it's so good. Mm -hmm. What do you think? It's delicious. It's delicious, yeah. I'm pretty happy with it. Hello. Morning. Good morning. We just had breakfast, um, started packing up and yeah, we'll head back to Sydney soon. Head back to Sydney um, soon. Yeah, we just wanted to do a quick first impressions of our new tent. Black Wolf Turbo 240 Plus. Yeah. <laughs> first impressions, first thing straight out of the box. Very heavy. good quality. It's heavy. Yeah. Like yeah. 35 kilos. It is 35 kilos. So, so it's heavy. Very yeah. heavy tent packed up in the bag, but really good quality, like straight up out of the box. You can just mm -hmm. tell all the stitching, all the Velcro, uh, the guy ropes. Um, every, yeah, it's, everything feels very sturdy and just really good quality, which I mean, you expect because it has a lifetime warranty on it. Yeah. It's a really expensive tent, so... Yeah, for us it's a very good size, I think, especially when we do our bigger trip. Yeah. Um, our yeah. bed fits perfectly in the back, and then we have enough room to put the table in if we need to. Yeah, some people um, might think it's overkill, but I mean, if we're going to be living in it for, you know, a year, then mm. 
having that room just to sort of if it's you know just horrible weather outside we can put our table inside we, yeah we can sit inside. inside and we've still got the bed and then all our stuff inside and it's set up and you know it'll be a little bit cramped but like yeah yeah it'll it's be, better, be than better, than, better than what we had which is just no cover at all held up really well in the wind last night the tent it's very um, windy and i've probably only put a third of the guy ropes and the pegs out uh, the window design windows mm. can be popped out which is good but still provide cover yeah for ventilation we did have to waterproof it but as you do with all canvas type materials yeah um, just get the stitching to swell to mm. size um yeah. yeah but yeah other than that i think it's going to be a very good home for us yeah thanks for watching if you've liked what you've seen make sure to give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel cheers